Good morning, first standard. How are you all? Before we start today's class, let's say the prayer. So please join your hands, close your eyes and pray. Mata, Pita, Guru, Devam. Amma, Achan, Teacher, Devam. Vridhal Alim Respectyanam. Avri Parnada, Kirk. Alright? Okay. So today it's a different kind of class. Um, I can, you can see me, and unfortunately I can't see you. But um, we are looking at syllables, okay? So yesterday I sent you the audio track, and I asked you to see two, three times. About words with one syllable. They say one clap. Apa ye? Nengaleng nala audio track ko kerta po. My parimbo. That's just one clap. Try one clap. Apa ini ye? One clap, two clap. Okay. A vidya saare manita teacher nna teacher video on jide the kanche. Okay. So nengalat chin. This is your chin. And you put your hand underneath it. And your all these words that are given below, baby, cry, carry, other we are going to say. Okay? And I'll show you. Okay. So put your hand under your chin and then you say the word my. Upper my. Can you see your chin comes down? My. Your, your chin drops. Left. How many times does it drop? One. Okay, just say it again. My. Can you can you see it in my um, in the in the video? So when your chin drops, it drops for a syllable. It is putting a break. Apa syllables paranada break gan kya mandi tana? Our syllables can't give up. Okay? So, my. It, it is just one drop. So, it is one syllable. Okay? Now, let's look at the next word, which is try. Okay? Try. Can you see that drop? So, it's one syllable. That is why for my and try, they put clap. They, they clap in the video. But, Minka the Chalapa Vegaman Slam, Chalpa the Budimutani, and then he clapped in an aramadi. So a syllable is where you break when you say a word. A break can't can anna this this hand technique, jaw dropping technique. Okay? So now there's another um, uh, this side there are words with two syllables. So that means two times the jaw will drop. Okay. So now let's see. The, uh, it is city and pretty. So now just look at my face. City. Can you see that? City. Can you see my jaw dropping? It's a very, very minute uh, change. But still, you can feel it. Pretty. I can feel it. You you put your hand underneath your chin and then say it, you will understand. Okay? So it drops twice. That means there are two syllables. Okay? Now, let's look at other words. Uh, yeah, all these words, okay? So let's go back to this. Okay, the first one is Bay B. How many syllables? Two syllables. Okay. Another thing you need to understand is uh, when you see a vowel, you automatically put a full stop. Okay. So if it is now in uh, Bay B, B A, one stop. And then B, Y, one stop. 
Y is not a vowel, but for the sake of a syllable, uh, for that sound, you use it, you think of it as a vowel. Okay? Because it says B, B, E. Okay? It is not saying Y. Alright? So, for because it makes the sound of a vowel, we consider it as a vowel for just for the syllables. Okay? Don't worry about anything else. Now, let's go back. Yep. The next word is cry. Now, when you look at that word itself, you know that there is no vowel in it. Okay? And it's just that Y at the end. So, you will know it's only one syllable. The next one. Carry. How many are there? Two. How do you how do you make sure? Just look at the word. It says it's C A. So A is the first stop. And then R R Y, the second stop. Okay? So that means there are two syllables in that. And when you say it, you know it because your job drops twice. Carry. Fly, okay. Fly, it's only one. And to make sure, if you look at it, you will know that there is no vowel in it. It's just a Y at the end, so it's one syllable. The next one. Now look at the word. It is H A P P Y. There is a vowel A, so obviously there is one break there. And then Y in the end, where the break comes again. Okay, so. How many syllables? Let's see. Happy. Two syllables. Okay. Now, let's look here. Now, when you look at the word, you find A and I together. Okay. So, take it as one vowel. When two vowels come together, they merge. Okay. So, you, they become very close friends and so you take it as one. Okay. They're together. So, it's one syllable. Uh, take it as one vowel together. So, so R A I becomes the first break, then N Y will become the second break. All right. So I am thinking two syllables. Let's see. Re me. Can you see twice? Now, uh, the next one. Sky. When you look at the word, you realize that there is no vowel. So it's a simple thing. Only the Y in the end. So it's sky. One, one vowel. Or one syllable. Now the last one. Y. Okay. Again, there is no um, vowel in between. So no confusion. It's just one syllable. Y. Okay. So... That is why I asked you yesterday to listen to the soundtrack two or three times. Now, whenever you say a word, if you want to find the number of syllables, think of it as you're going in a car, how many times you put a break? So, in a word, how many times you put a break? That is a simple explanation of syllables. Okay? So, any word, any, uh, even if it's a complicated word, just if you put your hand underneath and you keep it and see how many times it drops, you will find your syllables. And to make sure, just look at the word. If there is a, a vowel, that is a break. If there are two vowels, you take it together uh, as one, like in uh, rainy. A and I, both are vowels, but you take it as one, so that's one break. And then when there's a Y in the end, of obviously, Y because it sounds like E here, um, like re, ni, I'm not saying E, I'm not saying Y at the end, okay? So that is the second break, all right? So Y ending uh, words are, uh, Y ending words. Uh, words, uh, they have this this kind of uh, different sound, uh, e sound. Okay, so now like city. Now you know I is a vowel, so that is the first break, and then Y of course, and then keep your hand and you see C 
city. City. See, I, I can feel it. You may not see my jaw dropping, but when you keep your hand, you will definitely feel it. Okay? Um, uh, pretty. I know that there are two syllables. Let me check the word. Ah, P R E, that's the first break. And then T T Y, the second break. So that means there are two syllables. Alright, first standard. Um, this is one way of making sure you know how to uh, find out the number of syllables and then you can cross check. Make sure that uh, it is correct by looking at the word of the and see if there are vowels. Try to break it. Okay. So, yeah, that's it for today, uh, Stanton. Have a lovely day. Enjoy yourself. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Jai Hind.